Okay, this is a continuation from the install. Um, had a few problems with doing the um, installation, but basically uh, I've got it all going now. Uh, it was just to do with incompatibility problems to do with memory sticks and my um, computer. Um, but like I said before, um, you need to choose hardware that's compatible with FreeNAS. Uh, most of the information is available on the FreeNAS forums and so on. So. Hopefully, um, this time it should boot. Um, this is pretty much the first boot on this install. So, we'll see what it does. So it looks like it's got a couple of problems on the um, flash drive itself, but I'm not going to worry too much about them at this stage. I think we should still be fine for what we're trying to do anyway. So it's just generating some certificates and stuff for the install. This part um, takes a little while, but it's not too bad. Hmm, seems to be uh, taking a little bit longer than I remember it. But that should get there.
Okay, so it's finally finished that section. Um, if I get a chance, I'll shorten that down a bit. Okay, so it's basically into the uh, console. Um, and here you can set up things like the network card address, link creation, uh, VLAN, um, yeah, various bits and pieces, um, shut down, reboot the um, FreeNAS PC. Um, okay, so from here, uh, there's pretty much no, no more setup um, from this side that you really need to do. Uh, I've done link aggregation in a previous video. Um, yeah, so that that's just when you have more than one network card built into your FreeNAS um, server. That if you want to sort of split the load across multiple um, network cards, um, that's yeah, it's more. It's, how would I say it, it sort of load, load balances um, the data so that if you've got more than one PC uh, sharing files off the FreeNAS it can actually push data to each PC over a different network card um, yeah okay I'll leave it at that I'll um, continue on another video with the actual uh, logging into the web interface and showing you how to configure that um, and then go on to setting up the virtual machines etc